Item number SCP-040-JP Object Class Safe Special Containment Procedures SCP-040-JP has to be contained within a containment wing that has been erected to cover the whole area of SCP-040-JP. The containment wing is under the jurisdiction of Site-8120. When inside the containment wing, personnel are to be advised to never look inside SCP-040-JP. If it is needed to look inside SCP-040-JP, it should be done through the camera and not directly with the naked eye. If it is necessary to have a direct view, it is advised to use D-Class staff. Do not communicate with personnel who have been exposed to SCP-040-JP. SCP-040-JP is a well located in the village of in the Prefecture. It is surrounded by a wooden house, measuring approximately 5 meters wide and 4 meters long. The center of the hut houses a stone well presumed to have been built in ancient times, which descends directly underground. The well is abnormally deep and multiple probes have failed to determine how deep the well descends. Although the hut was originally locked tightly with iron chains and multiple padlocks, they were successfully broken due to deterioration. SCP-040-JP was placed into containment by 1967. Warning. After the incident of 040-JP-001 was detected, the following contents are prohibited from viewing without any mimetic countermeasures. In case of accidental exposure, please contact the Site Director of Site-8120 and request amnestics. When a person looks into the cabin, they begin shaking, reporting that there was a cat. Furthermore, the person will become obsessed with the idea that the cat is here. This effect is not apparent in drawings or images. It only occurs when a person views the inside of the cabin with the naked eye. A camera image only displays the inside of the hut and the reported cats could not be confirmed. Exposure to the target will distort the subject's perception of all domestic cats. Scientific name, Felis Sylvester's Catus. During interviews with exposed subjects, they reported that any domestic cat seemed to look like an animal with two human eyes on its face without hair or other features, staring at them directly when viewed from any direction. Furthermore, the exposed subjects will begin to report that the cat is constantly appearing in the dark for a few days to several weeks, and are constantly paranoid about the eyes of the cat. There seems to be no consistency in the level of darkness required for the cat to be reported, and the subjects report that they feel as if they are being constantly watched. It is not determined why the cat appears to observe the subjects. The cat looks like this. According to a survey conducted by Foundation researchers, it was determined that the location where the cat appears is influenced by the position of the subject's ocular lenses or the cornea. In other words, the sightings occur statistically significantly higher in the subject's peripheral vision. This property was demonstrated due to experimentation with D-Class in 19. According to the hypothesis proposed by it is speculated that the dark places in the large depths of the underground structure inside SCP-040-JP have a clear influence on this. Subjects exposed to SCP-040-JP will actively tell others about the idea that there is a cat. Those who have understood this idea to some extent suffered the same cognitive anomaly as the subjects who were initially exposed. It is not known whether the effect is transmitted through a general description or whether a specific trigger word exists, but it is a cat. There is a cat. There are no particular restrictions on the medium necessary to convey that idea, and it is effective even in all media such as speech, writing, images, and paintings. Therefore, it is speculated that the subjects themselves are not directly affected, but carry a mimetic anomaly. Refer to document. It was there. Affected subjects do not act in a suspicious manner, making it difficult to judge whether or not the subject is under the influence of the anomaly after passing through the first stage of exposure. It was a cat. Thank you. End of Mimetic Hazard Incident Report 040-JP-001 On 19 A large-scale mimetic disaster occurred in Site-8120 
as a result of this report. It is believed that the assigned staff and the upper staff were exposed to the memetic effects of SCP-040-JP at the time of submission of the report. Exposed personnel was subjected to amnestic treatment or termination. From this point onwards, memetic countermeasures are to be applied to all subsequent reports. Footnote 1. Memetic countermeasures are used so that we never repeat this blunder. Please be sure to perform the procedure before submitting future reports. Thank you in advance, IT Administrator.